Hello all to you budding coders out there, it's a big ho 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 from Professor Cody and it's time to code a Christmas game. In this game you have to open the presents that Santa has delivered and see what's inside. The catch is that the presents are magically floating around, making them difficult to catch. Now coders, before we start coding the game, why don't you hit the subscribe button so you can find out about fan dabadozy new games and some really cool Professor Cody competitions. And remember, if you like making this game, give it a big Professor Cody thumbs up. To start you off, I've already made a scratch template that includes all of the sprites and other resources that you need to make this game. To open the template, click on the link in the description below. Start by clicking see inside. The first thing we're going to do is make the presence move. So let's get a green flag block there and we're going to get a forever block and inside that we're going to get a move block and we're going to choose a random movement so that we can't be sure where the presents are going to go. So let's put that in there and let's get a turn block as well so we can turn at a particular angle there and again we want this to be random as well so let's get a random block for that as well, put that in there. And then finally, if on edge bounce, so that if it's on the edge of the screen, it bounces back into the screen. Okay, that's all done. Let's try that. And there's the present moving around, looking good. Yes, that's how I like it to go. Very good. So next thing we need to do is open the presents. So let's go to the costumes here. You can see there's three costumes for each present. So move that over a bit. And we're going to add some code here so that when we click on the sprite the present opens okay first of all let's change it so that switches the costume present one and we need to show that at the beginning of the game that's it so that every time you start it always starts back on costume one and now let's get the when the sprite is clicked block and when you click on the sprite you want to open it so we need to choose a different costume so we're going to choose the costume open so it opens the present and then we're going to wait a little bit very short amount of time 0 0.1 and then we need to switch the actual present itself so we're going to switch the costume and in this case the present is a donut every present has a different present inside it okay that's the donut and then we're going to wait again this time we're going to wait for a couple of seconds and then we're going to hide the present so you can't see it anymore. So let's just get a hide block there. And we're going to wait three seconds. So you, it will disappear for three seconds. Then it will reappear again as present one. So let's wait three seconds. And then we're going to switch costume to present one. And once we've done that, we need to show it again. Okay, so we'll go back to show at the bottom. Make sure it's present one. Get present one, put it in there like that. So now when we click on the present, I can click on it, it opens and you see the donut. Excellent. Okay, we're going to add some sound there so that when you click on a present, it says Merry Christmas. Okay, that's done. Merry Christmas. Now what we're going to do is add a score to our game. So we're going to add to this one here, set score to zero at the beginning of the game. And then each time you click on a present, you get one point. So we need to change that as well. So when you click on it, you get a point. Now we're going to get the green flag block. We're in the background now, and we're going to get a uh, forever loop. Put that in there like that. We're going to get some music. So the music plays as you're collecting the presents. So let's put that in here. We've chosen dance around as our music. So let's choose dance around. Yep, that's chosen. So now when you start the game, you can hear the music. Now we're going to copy the code by clicking and dragging it to all of the other presents. I'll show you the first one but you need to do the same thing for all of the presents, okay? So we'll assume that's all been done now. And we need, each time we change, we move the code to the, the other presents, we change the code slightly. So 
Obviously, it's not present one anymore, it's present two this time. And the present you get is a different present. This time it's a puppy. Okay, that's looking good. Let's change these. Okay, now they're all done. We click on the score there so we can see the score as the game's playing. So we click on the green flag now and we click on the presents. Each time we click on the present, we get one point and we can see the present we've got. So let's try to click on another one. There we go. The dog there. Another one. Yep. Oh, 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 it's hard. It's quite hard. But we're having a go. Now, I want to try some of our challenges. Well, coders, did you manage to complete the challenges? Well done. Remember to link your completed games in the comments below and why not let me know if there's a game you'd like me to make for you. Well, it's a great big ho 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 from Professor Cody. Until next time.